heißt. Um, so the first impression? Yeah, um, I really like the circuit. It is very challenging. So the first half is a bit like a roller coaster, up and down, left, yes. right, and uh, you have to push hard over the climbs, but also be safe in the downhill. Uh, about the road, uh, um, yeah, in the first half it's a bit rough mm -hmm. surface, so you have to choose a good line and um, hold your handlebar tight because it's a bit rough. Um, but all fine and. Uh, sharp corners in the downhill so uh, you have to um, really pick a good line and um, know how to uh, handle the bike very well mm -hmm. and um, then you come to the turning point which is a really beautiful town but in the race you have no time to look but I now cannot, I saw. cannot play them there will be the half point uh, uh, at this moment with uh, the time um, sorry will be the uh, ah, ah, yeah, split uh, time ah okay yes. perfect yes that's uh, perfect because from then the character of the race change mm -hmm. um, because it's uh, it's a road along the river and uh, you yeah, it's a full power aerodynamic uh, style of race uh, at this moment it's the last uh, the same last kilometers from the world championship uh, and 2000, ah. yes. Ah, okay. It's the 12 uh, last kilometers ah, are the same. Okay, okay. So it's a uh, road along the river and it's sometimes a bit down, sometimes a bit up, but yeah, pretty straight, small uh, yeah, changes in direction, but a uh, very powerful section of the circuit. And um, um, also the road is good and then towards the, the end you, it's a bit more tricky again. Uh, uphill and a small road and um, the new section you yes, showed me. Yes, it will so. be clean. Uh, yes, but race. it's a nice <laughs> section. And uh, so you, it's a bit more climby again and uh, corners and then I think that uh, all riders know the, the entrance of the finish because we race here lots of times and um, I think it's a really nice circuit, uh, challenging but also powerful um, and I'm really excited to come back and race here. Um, do you think it's a for a pure specialist uh, turn train? Um, what's important is that, <clears throat> you know, some time trialist specialists, they really can push lots of power, but um, they like more the straight roads, yes. and th this is not here. So you have to be someone who is a complete rider, so you have to be a really powerful time trialist, but also you have to be um, good in the changes of rhythm and uh, uh, also in the technique of the downhills and corners so I think it will be a, a nice race and for a rider who is yeah, very good in time trial but also super good on the, on the bike and uh, on the, on the combination bike. is it possible to do the world uh, woman race after um, um, then the yeah, so it will be. I think it will be challenging for those who have nationals also yes. there the weekend before. So you travel from nationals here, um, do the time trial, and um, for me, it's um, I think a bit harder because I have nationals then the time trial, and I also would like to do the road race and the mix um, oh, okay. time trial. So I think then the schedule is really, really busy. So you have to really think about uh, what to do with the World Tour race. But if you are more specialist for the road, uh, for the road race, I think then it's easy because you have a super nice race here on Tuesday, mm -hmm. and um, then you have a bit of time to recover before the 
road race of the European Championships. So you will not ride the World Women Race? Um, I haven't. Uh, so because it's so new, this topic, I don't know yet 100. But maybe that's a good plan. Yes. yes. For me. Personally. On the relay mix, it's good. Uh, yes, because I I like this a lot, and I did um, the already last year both races Europeans and Worlds and um, we won a medal both times so it's really um, also a nice and important race for me.